What mortgage insurance is, is it's legally required insurance that insures the lender against default. People putting 20% down is a thing of the past. You know, most people, you know, are not ready to do that. Or even if they are, they, if you ask your financial advisor, he'd probably tell you not to. What's happening in 2018 is the CFPB, the Consumer Financial Protection Bureau, has changed some of the rules around borrower paid single mortgage insurance. So, so to kind of back up, so, so there's a few ways to do mortgage insurance. What everyone is used to is monthly. And so that's the big expense. That's what people don't like. But you can also increase the rate slightly and not have any premium monthly at all. You can finance a premium in or you can pay it up front. So what's changed is the ability to pay it up front. This year, they made that a lot easier to do where it fits with the other laws. And one thing I was looking at a scenario where rates have come up three quarters of a point in the last year. Uh, on a $200,000 loan, that's $90 a month. So it's not a ton, but right. it can make a difference, okay? So I ran a scenario with this new type of mortgage insurance and it made a $110 difference in the payment doing this mortgage insurance, meaning that your payment is lower on a conventional loan in this scenario now than it would have been a year ago when rates are three quarters of a point lower. And so this is a big deal. It'll offset these, these rising mm -hmm. interest rates for a lot of borrowers.